Cloud storage is becoming increasingly popular and it's basically used by everyone right now. Our learning objective is to be able to define what cloud storage is and to be able to name some advantages and disadvantages of using it. When you're working locally, which means you're saving files directly onto the hard disk of the computer you're working on, it's important to save files often. This is because unexpected things could happen which could result in you losing your work. So it's important to make sure you save that work and keep it up to date so that you won't lose any progress that you're making. Instead of saving files locally on your hard disk, you could also save files in the cloud. If you're saving files in the cloud, it basically just means you're saving files on a service which you can access on the internet. Um, an example of cloud storage would be Google Drive or iCloud. Advantages of cloud storage are that you can access your files from anywhere as long as you have an internet connection. Um, it's a good form of backup storage, so if you ever lose your local storage device, you'll have all your information and data backed up on the cloud. You can usually store some data on it for free. Google Drive are an example which offer 15 gigabytes of free storage. And by using cloud storage, you'll usually save some money because you don't need any expensive kind of hardware. Disadvantages of cloud computing are that you need an internet connection. If you don't have an internet connection, you won't be able to access your information or data. It can be expensive on a long-term subscription and it's more likely to be hacked. Anything that you store on the internet or on the cloud is always more vulnerable to hacking.